I am a very, very strong believer in the Word of God. Mm -hmm. It has never failed. Mm -hmm. And the reason why I don't even spend my time and effort worrying about the outcome of the 2016 elections is found in Mark chapter 3, verse 25. What does it say? <laughs> it says that a house divided against itself cannot stand. This is the Word of God. It's not my Word. Which house is the, who is divided against what? I'll leave that to the people of Ghana. But any house or any political party that is divided, according to the word of God, cannot stand. Is the NDC not divided? Yeah. I am going to leave that to you and your public to decide mm. which po political party in Ghana to be. Mark chapter what? 3 verse 25. Mm. A house divided itself against itself. A house divided against itself cannot stand. In other words, a, a house divided against itself cannot win election. It cannot stand. And if you cannot stand, you cannot fight. And if you cannot fight, you cannot win. <laughs> the economic miracle of the eight years of NPP could not sustain itself. That means it was an inflated one. And I'll give you an example. HIPIC brought in a lot of money into the country because we didn't have to spend money servicing debt. The HIPIC money that came into the country was treated in one fundamental, uh, with one fundamental mistake. The money was not invested into infrastructure or into the productive side of the economy. The money was invested in the consumption side of the economy. So there was a false wealth that was created. And I'll explain it to you. The best news that I have, Paul, is that on the 22nd of November, Paul is going to take delivery of this first parcel of indigenous food. We bought a million barrels, well, Bost has bought a million barrels of 10 crew from uh, the, the second FDSO at Amez. It's going to come in here and we are going to refine products and we are going to sell to the Ghanaian market. Now why this is very exciting is because this is the vision of the founding father of the country.